Hi, my name is Felipe and I'm a sales engineer at Insightly. Today I'm excited to showcase an integration we've built with JotForm, an online form tool, using Insightly App Connect. This integration allows your team to upload files and sign forms directly into Insightly. You may be thinking, doesn't Insightly already do this? Insightly does have a native functionality for bringing web forms from the marketing and CRM sites, but this integration is particularly useful if you're looking for a way to upload files or include an e-signature section. For this demo, I'll use the example of someone filling out a health insurance application. You'll see that the application's fields will be reflected on the lead within Insightly, and that the original form and signature will be saved and cataloged for compliance post-air. This is a popular use case for customers who intend to bring in leads from various different sources. Imagine having to support multiple types of insurance forms or various health portals, each with different requirements and branding. This integration helps to bring all the data into one place, so leads can be easily managed and reported from a single platform. Let's check it out. What I have here is an example form with what would generally be included for a health insurance application. So we can see that here that we have uh, the portal being Acme. And I've taken the liberty of filling out the majority of these fields so you don't have to watch me do it. You can see that I have an insurance plan type, name, email, residential address, things like that. But the bottom is where I have a section for uploading documents and an e-signature, which is where the interesting stuff comes in. So as a user, I'd be filling out this info and I'd upload a document and sign it. So in this case, as far as a document, I have a sample invoice that could verify my address. I can agree to the conditions here. Set a date, which could be today. And then put my signature. Perfect. So from here, this is the information has already been sent down to the integration. And what JotForm automatically does is it saves a copy of all the formats to Google Drive. So for this demo, I've selected Google Drive, but there's also the possibility of using Microsoft OneDrive or another document storage system. So again, the integration is going to take this data, create a new lead within Insightly, or update an existing lead if it's already in the system. It'll fill in all the fields that we're taking from the registrant, and it'll also take those documents and save them to create a lead itself. For this use case, I've set it up to put it in a lead object, but keep in mind that the integration can create any object or number of objects with the form data inside them. So now I've switched over to the list lead list view in Insightly, and from here I can review all of the leads and categorize them and group them based on the information that came in from the form. So for example, we can see that we have the insurance type and the portal as well as the date of the form submission. So if I want, I can also pull in things like this as far as a portal and group this by the different portals that I have. And then I can also add this as well to split it up by the insurance type. I can go into an individual and see both the information that came in. So again, the portal, insurance type, marital status, any information that I put in here, as well as if I go to the related side, then I can see the files that were uploaded. So on one hand, I can see the actual form data that was pulled in, and this will be saved for future posterity uses. And so we can see that we have that signature as well as all of the other things that we've put in. Going back to the lead, I can also pull in that sample invoice that was sent in. So if we wanted to store this as well, later wanted to check in on it, we can have this information categorized and stored within the Insightly system. So if I'm ever called on to get this information back out, it's all organized and tied to that original lead. And this can be used for compliance later or if I get asked about this lead through a support email and want to check their documentation. Lastly, an important part of the system that we're doing here isn't just the data that we're putting in directly into the leads, but also how we can use that data in terms of analytics. So I'm going to switch over to an example dashboard set that I have for the information that we're pulling in. Some example reports that I've put together are shown here. So the first is an analysis on the different health portals. We can clearly see which brands are referring the most customers, as well as the differing insurance types that they're finding success with. So ideally, we may want to update our eHealth quote system, even though it's getting the most information in there. Uh, we might want to have it expand to different types of insurance, such as Medicaid, where it currently has none, although it is getting the most number of submissions. On the other side, we have a set which is mentioning the applications per month so we can see when these applications came in and we can compare them with the different months that have come in coming in. And on the right hand side, we just have a breakdown of the different insurance types in a pie chart. So again, these are just some examples that we could have to show the information that we can pull in. But again, once we get that information into the system, then we'll be able to get these kind of visualizations so that we're able to understand really what's going on with the forms that are coming in. Now that I've shown a few of the different things that we have within Insightly, I'd also want to show a bit into what we have with AppConnect and how the integration works. So going into this section, I've switched into the recipe. So I'm going to be showing this form that we have. Basically, it's a very simple recipe. We're just getting the video form information. We're waiting for a bit just so we can get that data into the system. So we're waiting about five seconds. And then from there, we're getting the folders and files from Google Drive. 
we're looking for the lead if it exists. If it does exist, then we can just update it, get that information, upload the file. And if it doesn't exist, then we'll simply create a new lead, get all that information from the files, and then put it in. This is just one example of how we can seamlessly integrate Insightly with a form tool like JotForm to streamline data entry. With this integration, you can automate form submissions, effectively categorize leads based on form fields, and ensure secure and organized data management, ultimately boosting your team's productivity. With Insightly's robust reporting and dashboard capabilities, you can gain valuable insights into incoming data and optimize your business operations even further. To explore how Insightly App Connect can tailor automation to your specific needs, reach out to our sales team for a personalized consultation. Thanks for watching.